The following feature is rated SM for spiritual maturity and is not intended for the immature who wishes to remain as such. The views expressed are not necessarily those of our sponsors as they sometimes could care less about what the host is saying but is more concerned about having their product on a popular show. Warning, small minds, listen at your own risk as this content is extremely overwhelming and may do further damage to those minds closed off to objective reality. Approach with an open mind as the heavy nature of the content will lick your chip. Your chip. In the meantime, 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 in between time. All right, purple people, welcome to another episode, another bonus episode of In the Meantime. Yes, episode 12. Yes, bonus episode 12. That one is entitled. Back of the class. But before we get night, you know, um, a whole lot of people are linked up on an issue here. They have a concern about what happened to the video podcast, The Rebellious Truth. Because they say, boy, them knowing themselves say that are the original from the first episode in the meantime, them say Rebellious Truth advertise. And them I wonder, you know, after all this time it it, it not really manifest yet. I did explain it in our one episode already. You know, I believe one or two episodes, no quote me. But listen, I believe 47 and 3 quarter. Yeah, 47 and 3 quarter. Uh, yeah, the timestamp, uh, um, 37 minutes, 47 seconds. Listen from this, and it will explain what go on with the rebellious truth. I'm going to touch it again, you know. I'm going to go more in depth and details in, a, in another episode. But through so much people have the concern, you know, I'm just bring it up tonight. But I don't really have the time to get, you know, going at the real, real nitty gritty height. But yeah, listen that time, you see how the sabotage real. Because what I made the plan for the originally was, you know, shoot the whole season one time. Pre-record the whole entire season. So I can get time for focus and stir it up. You know, and that way they know I could have just push out one of them a week and keep Purple Nation active, you know. But you don't know the energy when I'm up against. Call it Dark Force, call it Devil, same thing. But I'm not bitch about nothing, I just fix problem. One way if I fix problem, and I fix problem. But I tell you something, I go through some rascal to bring this, them thing at home, you know. I don't have a clue when I got you, believe me. But nothing can stop this. Only one can stop this. You don't want to stop this? Don't answer that. And for the people who are supposed to them dying for your past and moot again, and you don't have to understand this, this are bonus, these are bonus episodes. The official, in the meantime, season one, end. May I use my real voice because I don't want it sound the same. How no know when it, when it come back? How no go see difference? See difference? See difference? See difference? In the meantime. Alright, Purple Nation, help me welcome any IT support to the Purple Nation family. Any IT support is a technology company we focus on providing custom solutions for the home and business. Alright, let me tell you that in English. Any IT support is a cyber condom for all our the devices. Them. them protect the devices from all enemies whether are real or imagined. So this is a good news for cheaters especially. We have whole heap of things in our device to hide. So to all of my brother them out there, we have to sleep with one eye open. Because the girl has got to take on her finger and, and open her phone. Them days are done, man. Any IT solutions, met them, they have to go now, man. Call them now at 309-340-1364 or visit them website at anyitsupport.com. Don't just sit on the way the device is unprotected. Use a condom every time. Meaning, so use any IT support. The ultimate cyber condom. 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 In the meantime... In the meantime and between time, what is coming is coming. This section of In the Meantime is brought to you by Renaissance Immigration Services. Yeah, man, them deal with all things immigration in Canada. They're the greatest thing. Just call Renaissance at 437703 and the consultation is absolutely free. And please, members, if you're in America, you hear about Renaissance Immigration and say, well, I want a service like that, don't panic. You know what I mean? There is Lewis Law Professional Association. And like me always say, when the whole graveyard of immigration crosses are run your dung. Yes, Lewis Law can put a stop to it. Them deal with things like visa, citizenship, removal of conditions, waivers, and all matters related to immigration in America. Call them now, 954-530-171717. In the meantime... Go tell them, say, you're a star on the world, a curly locks around the world. 
You for know that. Know that. Know that. All right. So by now, everybody knows. Say, dance all artists. I don't even lose them son to cancer. I mean, just want to say condolences in our in, in our official capacity to I don't yeah. And uh, my wife, you know, and the entire family. In a time like this where everything is darkness and nothing no make no sense. And words meaningless. Like me said before. I'm not telling you why I bring up this. I because the situation with the Adonia is one of the biggest examples of something I have shown you. The longest while now. And it's that most of we not truly know nothing. We don't know nothing like know it for their, their fuck the opinions of we farm the strong opinions of we farm is not well informed and we, and we refuse to see it everything what we think we know is a not so educated guess and that situation sure the longest while now enough i want to miss you know beat the dog in a comment section all about when debate over which artist this and which artist that no I want to say him no boss I'll know him lazy him inconsistent him need for a drop song more regular him need for a drop song like 10 songs a week I want to know the comment when I say all about when the news drops say the man's son drop out why him never tell you say him I got you this or him keep this from him fans them or him never talk so it could have helped cancer awareness why more awareness you know about cancer why him never tell you no? Because you know, can't be trusted with Sheldon. And where Sheldon got you, at least me should have said more so. No. Can't you know what I do now? I don't give a fuck about Sheldon. I don't realize that if Sheldon is not good, it affects I do now. I don't just want what I want. I don't really care what is true, what is reality, what affects Sheldon. I don't just want I do now. So I have to suck it up and go to the best I do now. When can go now? Despite what Sheldon did I got you. But I don't think you know. So I don't make up on your own idea of what I think I prevent the idea of what I want. The man is lazy and him inconsistent. Same thing I say about me sometimes. At least the part about, yes, I say me inconsistent. It is true sometimes. I mean, know I lose all of support, enough time for that. But I'm not sure so I don't know what I say. I'm not sure I don't know what cause the inconsistency. I mean, I come ball like a bitch, you know. I just hold my strain like a soldier, you know. Got you, you know. Because that soldier, though. But stop going like on a no. It's a nine, 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 nine. nine. All right, the letter of the day coming to in the meantime, read a show at gmail.com is coming from Brandon Bradley. Yeah, man, Brand- Brandon, I say. Bless Vicebox, bless up Purple Nation. Big up Zion. I have three questions. The first one is, what do you think about the measures the government is putting into place to punish people who are found with child pornography? The second one is, how do you feel about the government remaining firm against the taximen's desire for amnesty? The third question is, what is your view on the sudden surge of songs glamorizing illiteracy? In other words, dunce culture. Would you say that the reason why it has gotten so large is that people who are not dunce but didn't get academic success is thrown into the same box as the actual illiterates. And therefore, they, along with their illiterate counterparts, are now just embracing what they have been labeled as by society, as an act of protest. What is? Do you, okay. Do you, as many believe, think that there is a correlation or link between illiteracy and hunger? I'm more than three questions that still, but here we are. All right, Bradley. So, to your question about harsher penalties for people when they catch with pornographic material of children or containing children, I'm totally welcome it. Them people don't know for their road. If I pick them in a back fist off, I'll finger for fly off of that fist there. And for those who don't know, um, pornographic material, you know, or anything where sexually explicit, you know, video or other material. So, yeah, man, I'm totally with that. But like almost every other proposal by the government for years, government on both sides for years, that one is a little too simple and don't make no consideration for the whole heap of things where make the innocent always end up suffer for the guilty. First of all, I run through the proposal and I not see nothing in the law where make no provision for people where can get them kind of thing there in a blast. And not even most of them have them. 
based upon how frequent or often them get blasts. <laughs> me certainly not check every blast when I get. I can't anything, you know. Me get blasts when I go back over like one year after me get the blast and somebody hit me say I cut off, you know. And in the next week, somebody can just not like you and send it to your phone and tell police same time when them send it to your walk and show people. And boom, my jailer gone and left the contract for the project with them go I me not see nothing in it to stipulate or state you know, in a, in a what kind of way and our circumstance it going to be considered criminal when them find it in your phone. In other words, which part in the phone, how you get it. I don't see nothing in a state it's a pending an investigation to prove or disprove so you did not use this type of material in, a, in, a, in a some sexually perverted way. It just if, if them find you with it and find in possession of it. It welcome, but it won't fix. But while we're on the subject of legislation and laws, how about actual penalty? For the parents, them, we're too busy upon the internet to protect them pitney from the internet. The problem now don't prevent. If the parents get more vigilant and become more responsible and find time for monitor them pitney activity like one time. No more than half a problem that gone. How about actual penalty? For child slavery. When parents send them picnic or sell all kinds of things when them they won't church out of sleep and the fun. I'm to your mother them when I put on them pot for them daughter front. Warm to the people them will take them sister and brother picnic country or town. Have them turn slave. Have them do the whole of the work while feed them picnic. I live like prince and princess. I'm to them issue there. And to your question now about how me feel about the government remaining firm. Against the taxi man, then when it come to this amnesty thing with the man, the man. Andrew can ball if the whole Jamaica starts to boy. He just want to score him, now run back and defend. And that's a leadership play. When you're firm, you're firm right across the board. And this is perhaps the only program on the internet where when politicians do anything, good or bad, it highlight. That one another good, sir. With all due respect. You can't strip on one set of people. And I said them for pay a ticket and this is discipline. Because they're not supposed to block road safety rules. Yes, it's good for firm, but the, the, the firmness they would be admirable. If it, if it was right across the board. Where the strictness gone about this road safety. When it comes to all of them people there. Eh, where they sit on the top of the, the JUTC bus them. And I make a bag of knives and go political rally. How them not get no ticket? I'm going to look on the screen right now. I'm going to see, I'm gonna see this, this. But I just talk about with the bus them and the people them. Look. You see the taxi man in my car is the whole like problem I road. I don't like them just as much as everybody else. But remember, twin reality. The situation look alike. But not everything or everybody in it are the same. You have only people who can do better with the ticket them. You know, and just do and do it. You have some of them who have more advantage than them colleagues. Some of them have Chris a car. Some of them drive the police or own car. I want it more things will give them a head start over them colleagues. And yet still, them choose to be a nuisance to other people who use the road. I don't like them neither. Just like everybody else. I said that again. But want to a little man with a little old car where nobody not even want to take unless the Chris care them food. He have even more demands for him life than them other man there. You know? And the situation will make him not pay a ticket way different from them other man there with them advantage there. You know? He have the same set of police we, we, we sit down in a gas station and write 100 ticket before him to the first taxi man. He might have them police that face him. And the same set of bills we, we name out in the last episode, you know. Plus a whole car him have, you know, factor in that we add up to maintain. When the cars are living higher than what you earn, something where you truly intend to do I go always get cut, you know. Because the priority them all come first. A man I go rather pay JPS, Water Commission, in pitney school fee. Police and bad man extortion, rather than pay a ticket where them even consider unfair most of the time in the first place. If him can't afford to pay everything, the one who consider saying can run from or get cut, and the one they're gonna choose not to pay. And not be a footer man who I walk be a footer. But you think me they'd rather have on shoes and have on no pants, no pants. Alright, if your question about the dunce culture, you know, me all get in that after me play the song away is back. By popular demand. The song is from a youth way. But believe in her. In the meantime, of the program, I met enough people know that youth and name. That youth and name, Jazai Lee. You can't kick down people and ask why they drop. And then when they react, they become the villain, the worst thing in the entire world. 
We don't have a question in our own role. You know, the problem them we don't find so difficult to deal with. Because we never take a balanced approach to these problems in the first place. From morning. The political structure of the country cannot keep creating, deliberately creating, idiot. Just so no can exploit them ignorance. And then expect no consequence from such a choice. A choice. A choice. A choice. A choice. Just I again for why you them Original road enough Yeah Hey father got this I'm a one on one My granny did that tell me but me never understand People love me crosses and bag and pan I the devil send them and never judge us plan See the freedom only come here so to chat and yam From a bar no one no real I just plot and scam And them wonder why the hammer them a knock and slam Cause when you make man fed up I just rap and pan See the freedom, yeah Man I try to live like a life But JPS pull up as me a thief like a life Just I again for why you them Original road enough Yeah Hey father got this I'm a one on one My granny did that tell me but me never understand People love the crosses and bag and pan I the devil send them and never judge us plan See the freedom only come here so to chat and yam From a bar no no real I just plot and scam And them wonder why the am and them a knock and slam Cause when you make man fed up I just rap and pan See the freedom yeah Man I try to live like a life But JPS pull up as me a thief like a life when you a striver that some people no like Bad mind like a them alone for reaching a life Mom wonder how some of them sleep in a night For no say people so far feed them reach for the heights Them have the cake and all me need is a slice All when them get the free them a give me for the price But me no dunce, me never born big A game them a play man I go change in cartridge If them a dig a grave all me can say I go and dig The master open up my eye, me see where them a go and hit If I done got this I'm a one on one My granny did that tell me but me never Understand, people love the crosses and bag and pan. I the devil send them and never judge us plan. See the freedom only come here so to chat and yam. From a bar no no real, I just plot and scam. And them wonder why the hammer them and knock and slam. Cause when you make man fed up, I just rap and pan. Yeah. You never see smoke without flame People are watching them out, it don't tame As you make a start of them first, I complain Fi mash up your business, but them labor in vain You see me, them never see me blood, sweat and pain Me never get no help, so I owe them one gain That's why me, careful and my strength, them one drain A little thing for go on of them first, I call me But me no dunce, me never born big A game, them a play, man, I go change a cartridge If them a dig a grave, all me can say I go and dig The father open up my eye, me see where them a go and weep If father got this, I'm a one on one My granny did that tell me but me never understand People love the crosses and bag and pan I the devil send them and never judge us plan See the freedom only come here so to chat and yam From a bar no no real I just plot and scam And them wonder why the am and them a knock and slam Cause when you make man fed up I just rap and pan In the meantime, Sixty six, King has a purple new shirt. When we say purple, we mean that. Just I leave with a thing when him people fed up upon the full charge label available on all reputable online platform. platform. Gangsta is purple. I tell you, Pablo said that. When we say purple, we mean that. All right, my books, Planet Hurt and the Road to Zion. Is available on Amazon.com. So get it, get Planet Hurt in all farms for Amazon. No. Yeah, man, I'm saying all farms, we are talking about audiobook. They're on Audible, iTunes, and not just about anyway, audiobook sell. And the audio version of the Road to Zion, so ready. You know, I mean, they had them knowing that ready. So, you know, get, you know, Planet Hurt locally at JA Deals, Constant Spring Road, you know, right across from the transport center. And check out them website, jadeals.com, for where them have them other locations, where so them also have the book on them. Thing. So, I make going to know that JA Deals also ship internationally to the Caribbean, etc. You can also get Planet Hurt upstairs, Island Grill, Twin Gates Plaza, in a place named Cellular Repairs. 
And it also has a selected location, a Kingston bookshop. And also, if you have selected time, JA deals, you know, they might have a limited 10% discount on the book. So, you know, find out more about that in our description. And I can also pin a comment with various ways of getting on from planet Earth. Do it now. This next section of In The Meantime is brought to you by Renaissance Immigration Services. As you know already, them deal with all things immigration in Canada. Your days of painting card green is over. Them fix the visa where you overstay because you're frightened and run off and now people are take advantage of you in every way, shape or form. And you work for less than where you work. And you feel so there's no way out. Renaissance believes that as long as there was a way into your immigration problem, there is always a way out. Just call them now at 437-703-1147-8. And as usual... The consultation is absolutely free. In the meantime. In the meantime, in between time, what is coming is coming. Yeah, you know. A truth and reality and a dream time. Curly locks. In the meantime. 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 Ah, so to your question, what I'm going to say, you know, the reason why this dunce thing gets so large is that, you know, people who actually not dunce but never get academic success, them throw them in the same box as actual dunce people and therefore them just an embrace where society label them as and hack it out as a mark of protest against the label. Countless time pan a show, I'm sure you not hear me tell you. So the majority of people go with what is popular, not what is wrong or right. Everybody react to this whole dunce thing for the same reason. Why them react to every other trend for your much century. And that's because it's in a style. Now me first tell you know that. The accountant or bank teller we drive out of the bank. I play the biggest song about murder. And a gunman. No. Them simply just a rework the lyrics for line up with whatever struggle them are facing for them life. Right now them turn around dance and I use it like sarcasm. Who don't know what that means? Look it up. Them tail light for fit any situation with a boss, with a family member. You know, for them story, it, it, it means say, you take me for idiot. Take me for a big idiot. AKA dunce. But me I gotta show you. And as usual, them overlook what it means to an actual dunce for see everybody I embrace it. And a boss blank. Pakum, pakum. So while majority intention might harmless. It had a serious damage to the people with the actual dunceness. If you see this disability as normal. Because of that dunceness really is a disability. And them see when they think it's harmless. I just a song and a metaphor. I got ball a little more down the line. When them want to tell you much dunce now, we're comfortable with that dunce identity there. Say dunceness out of style. And this is how problem start here. Give them a taste of respect. And them now go let it go back. And go quietly into the night. Go start shame again. We're not telling all the while. Said dunce is not an academic reality, but a spiritual reality. The dunce man and the bright man dunce for the same reason. You know? The two of them lack serious information. None of them can read them life for save it. There's almost no difference between a man who can read and a man who can read but don't read, you know. Both of them lack the information. We have to help them with proper choices. And both the dunce dunce are the, and the bright dunce. Dunce because they're lazy. Another reason, which is possibly the biggest reason why both dunce and bright attracted to this whole dunce. And back of the class kind of song is that the whole of them negative kind of music are gospel. Because they love any excuse where they can push up front when they're indisciplined or work out. Later down the line. And that everybody, including whole heap of educated people, are real for. Yeah, man. The real message in that song is glorified dunceness. I'm just an underlying message where most people are resonate with. I wear them like, now have a thing to do with being bright or being dunce. And that them why everybody think. But both bright and dunce attracted to the music for the same reason. I tell you again, that's a perfect excuse for fail. All them think is that if them have the perfect excuse as to why them not have to do certain things, then them not have to do it. Them can just have all the fun in our world now. 
So every time anybody tell themselves they're going to negotiate with life and work hard for something where they want, that's life can reward them with that something there. Them just present their excuse and get back to being free from the blame for where them there in life or where them not achieve or what not going for them. Them can go on indulging at them. Instant gratification, meaning so them can go on get everything. Now anything cross their mind, them can just do it now, but that have a consequence later on in life. Because them not go can forget See the lie that them, them did I live. You think them don't know so them can do better? Them just fucking lazy. I that most people do, no? it's not complicated. It not nothing to do with dunce, gunman, government, all of that are excuse. Most people know better. Them just why everybody think them don't. Most people don't look for the truth in or nothing, you know. Them look for anything where line up with where them want to be true. Because truth require work. And what you going to say about people can learn because they're hungry? It, it, it's too simple. The next thing is too simple. I'm telling you about the program from the beginning. I'm telling you from the stir it up. See, one thing you have to have and can't do without when you want anything at all and that's interest. Without interest, nothing can keep your focus. I'm going to tell you again, interest is an anesthetic. That's the injection of them give when you go to surgery that you can't feel nothing. Learning like everything else. If you're not interested in something, whether it be a relationship with a spouse or a job, same thing. If you don't have no interest, you're wide awake in a surgery and you feel everything and everything bother you. Wait, so when people are hungry, they can't focus. Then why them never wait till them eat before them fucking high class? I will put them video the way see with the picnic go with a bag of things, you know. Not enough hungry picnic that they are looking you know. Then how would stand up if hungry have the power to make your can't focus? You look like hungry, I want a little pervert, man. How we little girl, we are going to school. Got a boyfriend yard, every evening go fuck. No day no miss. Lone bed at tear down. Pan her hungry belly. Sometime I'll two, three days, I never eat, you know, so how many get so good at English? Biology, social studies. I never so good at maths at that time. Because I never interested in it. When the maths teacher come at torture, if hungry did have a direct link to a lack of focus, then I would learn nothing at all. I can ask again, it take a whole lot of energy for fuck. If I hungry, then the whole of Ethiopia and Somalia in, in a certain period of history. No, no, would I stand still? And can't move till after the famine? You can't go research the famine for yourself for much week. People not eat. A hungry man, a breed hungry girl. And girl breed when they look nine months time, a skeleton and a slide out of them. The real problem with them picnic over them parents. Cause them parents are picnic too. And this are the root of the problem. The mother and the father are picnic. If a youth not have him own idea, a why him go to school and can develop him own, him or her own conviction as to why them have to educate themselves. Then it's hard for them interested. Now me first telling them that this is a culture problem. With culture for say education like poison, like like something destructive. An educated man in a ghetto when me a grow up. It was like a batty man. Uptown batty boy. You didn't know say so it's scientifically proven. So the human brain function better when them hungry. You have a public research university in a Wales. We have a brother named Jeffrey Davis did numerous study and confirm what me just say without any reasonable doubt. Scientific study indicate so our stomach hormone named ghrelin, G-H-R-E-L-I-N. We come a few hours after you eat and your belly empty. Actually enhance cognition, meaning awareness. You think a coincidence that every kind of spiritual people from all different types of culture and religion, anytime they want to read certain frequency, them fast. So me no buy that. There is too much things that people just say. I just say back because somebody else said it and we don't look deep into it. Not saying this 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 is in your case, you know, Brandon. Okay, actually I ask a question. So it means you, you know you want a different perspective. Me not have no subject now, you know. A common sense. Me, me do what I did today, you know. But me don't be a damn liar. If me tell us an education you know, And yes, yeah man, yeah. The same brainwash education. Yeah man, I hate me I talk about. Add enough value to my life. How? Become a common sense. Show me how to use it. What is hurtful? What makes sense? What not make no sense? It helps me filter it. Keep what valuable to me. And show me how to dash away. 
were dangerous. Common sense is powerful, but if you don't expose yourself to knowledge of the civilization where you're living, at, the, the, the civilization where oppress you then, then how you fight it? You have to have the information if you common sense and like have something to work with. Let me go on the biggest example, how I mean when I say this. Shaka Zulu, for those who don't know, one of the greatest, if not the greatest, military strategist the world ever see. Them say a Napoleon, but a feed them story that. Them are going say that. That a common sense for them. Shaka and the Zulu warrior them in a South Africa. When the British them be go for conquer South Africa, them free the Shaka Zulu. And them Zulu warrior them like posts, several posts. A common sense Shaka used to become such a formidable force, you know? such a force to be reckoned with. You know? And when them use get out Shaka, some ABC idea where Shaka no exposed to, where Shaka no know nothing about. And this is how we're being done, do to it, make you guess about everything. And make up ideas about anything at all, you know, understand. It, you know, where them use and get him out. Simple here, die. Them die Shaka Grey here. And Shaka think he young again. And because of that, the mighty Shaka bow down to them. I see, I see for them is Angoma, I that them call Obia man. For them is Angoma, stronger than for him own. Because them have the power to make him young again. And him no see no is Angoma. We can't do that. He never see one of them there yet. You see, when the man them bring in a cannon and bust that ball, and you see 200 African skin out, Shaka said they have the power to control thunder. Ignorance to some simple thing. Make the greatest warrior will come this close to kick the British out of South Africa. Paul, if you don't know your enemy, you can't defeat them. Our enemy, bright. None of them no don't. Let me say it again, I never have the subject. But I never die back in class. For what? I didn't know so that education is important. I'm going to need it for you. I don't need subject. I need the information that I can function properly in the world. When you're done, you're always anxious. Because you don't understand nothing. You're quick for getting mad. You don't calm about nothing. Because when nobody at all talks, you can't imagine what they say you have to make it up. And you can't do what you have to make it up. And when you don't understand it, you can't conclude. You can't decide if you know it or not. And that makes you so angry. Because you can't settle down. You can't calm down. Because you don't know if you get it right or wrong. And you just live in that state. Eh? And that you don't sing and celebrate. And that state you don't celebrate the people for living there. You know? Educated scam are the best one. Them, you, know? you don't see them every day. Come tell you which road one fix. Don't take away money. You don't see them again till the election. And they don't bust up and make noise. You know what them so good at them scamming? Because them know something you don't know. And you, you refuse to know it because you're fucking lazy. Now who you think scam you into blaming even them same one of them? You know? Because when you're obsessed with them, you blame and blame and blame and blame. You know, get to figure out the one thing we stand up in your way. And are you. Them so good at them scamming. That them scam you know. Into thinking so on a downfall and on upliftment and on upliftment and on a downfall. Them scam you know. Make you think say. To educate yourself. Like them is a negative thing. Them <laughs> scam you know, till you can't even notice. It's so election time, no motorcade no go through uptown and high society. Because the kind of ignorance and naivety where them get their money and power after, no up there. So. Them scam you know, till you know, fight monks in a self uh, and destroy one another and loving it. When an artist, we are so no fully dance, but manager Rabino, you know, and on a ball. You know, say you don't know nothing about your own affair because you dance. You know, say I fight the youth, a lie. You know, say I'm a bad man. I don't give a fuck. A fuck. Hey! In the meantime, 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 in the meantime.